never see the light of day again. Please, just tell me what I've done. What have I done? Hey guys, I am Voxfire, and this is Vox Plays RPGs: The Tower, Part One. Uh, the Tower is a game, a indie game made by Narrow Monolith, and that's really all there is to say. Let's uh, let's jump into it, and you'll see more. Done enough for today. Come on, let's go find some boars. I wasn't sure if it had been the malt or a simple lack of attention, but it didn't matter. The jailer's carelessness would be his misfortune and my opportunity. Whilst my cellmates fell prey to the torment of our captors, I would slip free. The only obstacle between me and the long-forgotten sensation of sunlight on my skin was the darkness of the tower. An unnatural, ceaseless darkness that only served to further claim the minds of all who remained imprisoned here. Those fucking guards are total dicks, I guess. But then again, guards A generally are. torch allowed me to assess my wounds. My wrists, raw from years of shackled mistreatment, itched as I surveyed the black, stony corridor ahead of me. The guards had left to find solace in whichever poor wench would let them. I, however, would find solace in the fact that they were no longer around to prevent my escape. Can I... can I take the torch? I... I guess not. Traversing the darkness of the tower requires great concentration. Becoming disoriented is easily achieved. Listen for subtle sounds and guide yourself to their source. Your aim is to find the next torch, which is located in the next respite area. Remain undetected and pay attention to your surroundings. All right. I remember stepping into that first corridor as if it were only an hour ago. The damp, cold walls of that demented stone brushed against me as I felt my way through the choking darkness. A darkness that the devil himself feared. No fucking kidding, this is really dark. I can't see anything at all. Apparently walking into a wall. Oh god. I can't see where I came from. Oh, oh I ended up back there. Shit. Holy. Am I even making progress? I can't tell if I'm making it anywhere. I can't see anything whatsoever. Oh man, guys, this is like the darkest game I've ever seen. Oh, it's in some water or something.
I have to follow the sound of the dripping water over there. Oh, thank God. Light. Light? I don't see any light. Oh, oh! Light! Oh my God! <laughs> I thought I'd never make it through that corridor. It must have been miles long. Um, resting allows you to save and forge useful items and access the menu. Uh, once the torch has been lit, you can rest at any time by using the straw pile. Once ready, you can enter the next part of the tower by activating the next traversal. Reaching that first torch seemed like my entire body was pulled from the cold. I would rest here, if only for a little while, before venturing any further. Shall I continue my tale? If I go backwards, I can... Oh. Oh, I found... More light. Food was a major concern. Or rather, the lack of it. The guards were always given plenty of ale and rich, hearty meals. Another, if indirect way, of torturing the starving inmates. There was a guard station up ahead. I could smell chicken. Cooked potatoes from where I was hidden in the shadows. If I was going to continue, I needed to eat food. I needed to take theirs. It'd be impossible to sneak past the guards until and Elliot must eat. You can use the darkness to your advantage by blowing out nearby torches to engage combat. But I. I don't want to, but uh, fine. Hey, who the hell put the lights out? Come on, come on! Who the bloody hell's that? Oh, someone's got me! Get him off me! Stab him! Oh! Uh, I... Oh. Oh, okay. Son of a bitch. I... Check those prisoners. Double check their shackles. I, I guess I died. Hey. Come on, come on! Who the bloody hell's that? Someone's got me! Get him off me! Stab him! Stab I got you, you son of a bitch. There was a knife and a small loaf of bread on the table. Before I even knew what had happened, I'd stabbed one of the men in the side of the head with it. Damn right! I screamed and faded into the darkness. A sword rattled in its hilt as the man I had restrained reached for his lifeline. I squeezed my arm tighter to his throat. His breathing faltered. In desperation, he began to elbow me feebly in the ribs. His strength was fading. If we could see this, I bet we would think it was really epic. I snapped his neck quickly. He burbled and fell across the table. Silence. I had killed them. Then I ate. Fruit. Chicken, potatoes, bread. I didn't think about what I had done. I was surviving. That's great. Can I put the torch back on now? Because it's kind of really fucking dark.
Looking up as I entered the cabin, I saw sunlight. My god, it was beautiful. The silver pool nearby glistened as I resisted the urge to drink from it. A curious a death blooming color of shimmer could be just as painful back. as a jailer's oh. sword. I picked oh. it, assuming it should come in useful later. Oh god guys, don't don't touch anything while he's talking, otherwise you'll hear him talking twice. It allows me to see in the dark. Fuck yes! Oh. Oh my god. Another torch lit, another chance to rest. My run-in with the guards was careless, but necessary. I couldn't always count on finding a bound of shadow. I stood from the straw and ventured onward. A curious, glowing plant shimmered next to the pool's bank. I picked it, assuming it should come in useful later. As I braced to enter even more darkness, I recall to mind simpler, happier times. The land and farm that I used to own on the outskirts of Surrey was a happier time in my life, but ironically, it's what led me to the tower in the first place. It, oh, that's not... Okay, um... On the work log... Dude, your memories are really blurry, bro. You do. Till the soil. Gather dew crops for court. Plant new seeds and water sprigs. Gather more wood. Repair northern fence. This is pretty cool for a uh, pre-release. I can't wait to see what they do once they uh, uh, finish it. Really pretty, but at the same time, it's this guy is very nearsighted. If you can tell, because everything's blurry at a distance. Gather the crops. You go on, I'll be okay. I can dream the rest away. It's just a little touch of fate, it'll be okay. It sure takes its precious time, but it's got rights and so have I. There we go. Got all the crops. Alright, let's storm in the shed. Ah! Oh, oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> let's pretend that was what was supposed to happen. <clears throat> Uh, find the shovel. Find the shovel. If I were a shovel, I'd probably be in the shed. But then again... I guess I don't know... Oh! Oh! There's a shovel. Turn old crop bed soil.
Plant new seeds. God. And suddenly, just like that, I'm playing Harvest Moon. Uh, okay, so do I have to grab the seeds? Where the fuck are they? Probably also in the shed. Except they're not. Wait, oh. Wow. Really? How the fuck was I supposed to see that? I mean, sure, the seeds themselves were... I am the most magic man that has ever lived. Mr. Fantastic over here. Where the hell is this trough? It looks like the water can watering can has plenty of water in it to me. I mean, look at that. It's got so much... Oh, it's right there. Well, apparently, my Mr. Fantastic powers only go this far. Water seedlings. Can I can I Mr. Fantastic this shit too? Yes. Fucking stretch Armstrong over here. Mr. Fantastic. What do I do now? Tasks remain incomplete. Oh, uh, what was my next task? I don't remember my next task. Oh God. Don't let me back in the house either, so I can't check the list. What do I do? Oh, found it. Find the hammer. Didn't I just find the hammer? It was floating above the broken fence. Uh... All that work to get in here, and it's not even in here, is it? Oh, it's right there. It wasn't even glowing or anything. How am I supposed to know? Just kidding. Fuck, collect some planks. Gotta do everything around here. There's planks right over there! I can't collect the planks. Oh, wait! I can't collect them from up close. I must be further away. My arms have not retained their normal shape from stretching across the yard. 
I fucking used the ha the planks that were already there in the first place. What the fuck? This is bullshit. I'm stuck. Well, it's happened, guys. I'm completely stuck. I can't move. I guess I'll end this video here. <laughs> I'll pick this back up from where I left off with the farming.